Hello there, I'm the Rampant Mystic, and welcome back to Imperium Galactic Survival. And today, we are going to be doing a little bit of exploration before we do the big stuff, because... Ah, well, I'm recording this on Christmas Eve, because I actually thought I had one more episode uh, pre-recorded, but apparently no, I have been mistaken. So anyway, Merry Christmas to everybody, and Happy Holidays! Yeah, let's uh, begin off with that note. Now, um, I have upgraded our ship a little bit. So one extra advanced uh, medium thruster. Uh, this one was upgraded to advanced, actually, on both sides. Of course, I'm referring to the thrusters on both sides. Because uh, because of all the steel plating, last time when we filled it up, I could barely take off the ground. So that's why we needed extra thrusters, plus extra storage. Because why not at this point? I mean, we have 4,000, so I was like, you know what? Let's explore for a little bit, yeah. And we should be great on CPU. Yep, we're absolutely great. Like, these take almost no CPU, and neither do the thrusters, so we're good. It's mostly the weapons, the RCS, and a whole bunch of other stuff that does actually take a bunch of CPU, but this one does not. Now let me turn that off. Everything's full. We actually have way too many Pentex ID crystals. I should just call them Pentex crystals. They would be a lot easier. So I'm gonna leave some here, uh, like half, yeah, 60 is more than enough, because that does have a weight associated with it as well, so this will actually help us increase our speed. Now today's episode is gonna be mostly exploring the immediate area, and next time around um, we are going to be doing, you know, the usual stuff. We're gonna be going to mine some cobalt, hopefully survive, and if not, well, that's gonna be horrible. Wait. Oh, look at that. That's actually missing. Just noticed that. Look at that. So the extenders are airtight, but here, here they're, it's, we're missing blocks. Okay, this was a bad idea. <laughs> this was a bad idea. Okay, we can do it in space. We can repair it in space. I just noticed that. Oh, can't believe it. I even worked a little bit on that side. Oh, well. All right, let me quickly uh, pull up the repairs. Ah, uh, no, we are immediately leaving. Okay, right, I forgot, Xerax. Now, this is a place where we haven't been, but that's way too close. I want to go to the ab abandoned shipping pallet. Because, I mean, I'm, I was kind of curious last time I didn't mention it, but I kind of was. And now I want to see what it is. Why are these things after me? What have I done to them? To deserve this, there's a bunch of wreckages. I guess maybe that was the intention of how to build a capital vessel, just go in. Take a bunch of parts from the wreckages and just do something. Build one somehow. I guess that is possible. Oh, hello. Right where we have almost no stopping power. I forgot. I forgot about that. All right, let's turn around. Because we currently don't need... Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, the problem is that thing is coming here. For the love of, I won't be able to take it on. I mean, I can. I. Oh boy. Uh, yeah. Okay. Just take whatever I can. How far away is it? It's two point three. As soon as it gets to one point five, I'm leaving. Boy, well, I'm gonna take everything. All right. So let me do at least the top row. You know, it would have been nice to do this in peace. Just gonna point that out. Most of this stuff is gonna end up being thrown away, but... Oh, okay, it vanished off my screen, that's not good. Uh, please enter, thank you. There it is. Okay, it's, I don't think it's looking for me. Yes, I'm not actually entirely sure, but the game does seem to spawn these uh, interdictors or whatever. Uh, it, like, sort of close to asteroids, I think? Or at least that's my- oh, look at that. As soon as you think you're safe. Like, I wasn't safe down on the planet, now I'm safe- I'm not safe down here, up here as well. And I really want to loot that pallet. Eh, it's coming here, there's, there's no point in just waiting around. Alright, let's go for that. For these, uh, wreckages. There's like one more abandoned shipping pallet. Okay, maybe not go through that. Okay. I know there's one closer, but I want to just go away from the Xerox as quickly as possible. I don't want to get hit. We barely have any defense anyway, so... We're just going over there, and we're hoping that it's not going to follow us. 
but of course they will. Now granted I could slap on a couple of extra turrets, but that, that's not going to keep us very safe for very long. Uh, plus, that would actually mean that I would have to remove certain things, like for example all the cargo, because we're going to need extra ammo and that's going to weigh us down. That's extra CPU as well, so it means I'm going to have to remove certain things like the drills. Uh, it means I'm going to have to actually go for hardened steel or whatever, just so that the ship survives a little bit longer and so on. So there's a lot of compromises that I'm currently not willing to make. Uh, please stop, please stop, right? Please stop. All right. As I said, there's a lot of compromises that I'm currently not willing to make. Now what I will do though, is I will turn on at least the turret. The reason for that is as soon as I hear it firing, because I won't be able to pay much attention. But as soon as I hear it firing, I know there's something nearby. Of course it's coming here, of course it is. Is it actually gonna- no, okay, I think it stopped. No, it didn't. The exclamation mark is still there. Like, what do I need to do so that these things at least don't follow me? I mean, except kill them. Destroy them, sorry. I don't know. They, they, they're just AIs, so it doesn't matter. Why, though? You know, I want to actually do this wreckage. It's still coming. I know I could have done something by now, but... I want to see if the exclamation mark will actually go away or not. I could try and take it on. You know what? We are going to try and take it on. I'm just going to save quickly because I'm pretty sure this is a mistake, so. Alright. It is coming here. There's there's no, like, there's no doubt about that. It's coming in a very weird pattern, but it is coming here. Still ha has that exclamation mark. He is getting closer and closer. Problem is, I think that as soon as I engage it... Oh, is it's actually going further away? Okay, uh, I, the problem is as soon as I engage it, are these things even on? I think I turned on off the, all the weapons off. Oh. Okay, it's leaving. Nice. Let's go. In this case, we don't care about it. Oh, these are very far away though. I need to get closer. We don't have an EVA boost. We need gold for that. We'll scan once more just to see where it is. It is two point... What is it doing? I don't get it. I really don't. I I really don't. It it should either attack me or don't. But don't do this weird like, oh yeah, I'm coming close, then I'm gonna go away. But alright, it's definitely attacking you. 1.28, 1 1.25, yep. Turn on all the weapons. Our weapons don't have a lot of range, but Starting a little bit of pre-fire here. Okay, maybe not tank the whole damage. That'd be kind of nice. Okay. Okay, it's doing the evasive maneuvers. The weird ones. <laughs> what the... How? Okay, no, no, no. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Turn around. We need to keep firing at it. We're not getting cold, this means we don't have any hull damage, that's good. Okay, I think I got it. It's yellow. Now, how many more are headed this way? More. At least one more. And it's very close, so if I'm gonna get anything from this, I need- Why is this still open? Didn't I close that? Okay, nice! Okay, the Scotium alloy is nice. Again, most of the stuff I really don't need, and it's probably going to be thrown away, but... 1.5, it is very close. Okay, let's get into combat again. Keep in mind, my ammo is very limited as well. I think it... No, it didn't stop. I thought it stopped, but... No. You know what? Let's get into combat. Start the pre-firing. I can tank, like, one hit. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, hello! Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. Ah, uh, that's the wrong thing. That's the drills. Oops. I really wish these, the turrets had like slight auto-aim. You know, your target's in front of them, so... Just slightly auto-aim them, so I don't have to do it. What do you mean change the hostile? It's not like they were being friendly towards me, you know. Just gonna point that out. Uh, 
Right, hold. Is anything else actually coming this way? There's an interdictor 700 meters away, but it's not coming here. Wow, I can barely believe that. Alright. I think we just managed to deal with them. But granted, there was only two of them, and hopefully this time they will not ambush me like last time. Now that... That was just taking a piss. Oh, they don't weigh that much. I kind of do want to take them. Yeah, they, they weigh almost nothing, and I have a feeling like one day I might need them, so... Why did I stop so far away? That being said... What did I take damage to? I, I know I got hit at least once. Well, we're gonna find out sooner or later, so. Uh, where's my oxygen? Oh, that right. I right, right. actually left a spot here so that I can easily use it, even though I could have turned it around. Just saying. Alright, back to it. Yeah, yeah. As I said, as I said, something's gonna ambush us. There, there's one. You cannot escape them. You just can't. Alright, turn around, open fire. Make him do the dance. You know we're gonna run out of ammo before we run out of enemies, probably. And considering how accurate this is... Okay, I think I just need turrets, to be honest. The one turret is just keeping it spinning for some reason. I think that's an AI issue. Actually, I'm pretty sure it's an AI issue, but... The one turret keeps them spinning, so the only thing I... Okay, we're reloading, that's bad. This means we're out of bullets. Alright, this one's gone. Oh, negative 107, great. We have... A hull breach. All right, let's quickly find it. <sighs> Great. Where, what did it shoot out? Oh, no, now what? How many things did it shoot out? Jeez, that was with like one or two hits. Are you kidding me? Are we okay now? Are we okay? Yeah, we're perfect now. As long as we don't get shot at, we're, we're perfect. I do want to loot it, and nothing's coming this way, right? Problem is, I can't really tell. I know I'm low on food, that's fine. We'll, we'll eat some. Problem is, we're out of food. Uh, actually, I was uh, thinking about this. Uh, recently. I think it was yesterday. It doesn't really matter. I was thinking about that. Oh, they shot off the Wi-Fi. Great. Great, great. great. I'm gonna have to replace a lot of that stuff now. Like the Wi-Fi and whatnot. I should have definitely fully steeled, steel plated this thing up, but whatever. It's fine. Now let's go towards our... Uh, where are my wreckages, actually? The ones that I wanted to loot. No, not those. Actually, I think it was those. But those have an interdictor there. Okay, well... Or are these the ones I destroyed? I think- oh, these are the ones I destroyed, okay. That makes a little bit more sense now. Please tell me nothing else is coming this way. Right, I think I took care of- hello, stop, 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 oh, reverse. Make a U-turn. Come on. Alright, first... Oh, we don't have any Wi-Fi now, do we? Uh, oh, we do have a Wi-Fi. Wait a minute. Only extensions got shut off. No! What got shut down? There was something there. Did the fuel... Did one of the fuel tanks get shut down? No. I noticed empty space! Oh, I think it was the empty space here. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, so actually nothing got destroyed. Okay. Okay, I was panicking over nothing. Okay, that's fine. I'm paranoid, I know. I'm paranoid, but I want to check. There's nothing coming nearby. Now I'm going to need to do this in... In spurs, in waves. Anything I do... Oh, that was a lot of fuel, though. Alright, so anything I don't need is going to be thrown away. Like, for example, cement. I'm pretty sure I can get rocks or stone dust. I can get rocks as much as I want and relatively quickly, so I don't care about it. It just weighs me down. And we're gonna have to do this in waves since I can't actually uh, auto loot this, and I can't loot it with the uh, thingy. 
with the drone, so... Yeah, this is the only way. I do have a couple of cores, so if I do actually want to salvage something, like for example if these are uh, steel blocks, let's say, and I have the room, I can actually salvage them, but... I'm not really here for that yet. Right. Oh no! What the...? Okay. I was not expecting that's a lot of copper that I don't need. Uh, okay, at this point I'm gonna stop taking the copper. Alright, enough of that. Enough of that. No, no, seriously though, I guess you're supposed to like come here if you need copper, but I don't. I guess there must have been an explosive block or something over there. Okay. I guess this is timed. Oh, there's the core. I guess there was like an explosive timer on it as soon as you like come close to it. Let's see what you have. Titanium plates, sure that'll help. Plastic nanotubes. A core from an alien faction, which I don't care about unless I want to retrieve it of course. And a container controller, which has... Sure, I'll take the iron, sure, but... It's not that big of a deal. It's iron after all. Okay, there's nothing here. I was gonna repair that. I totally forgot. I can do it in a moment. Come on, get it. Get it. <laughs> no, well, I can do one of them. That's not happening. I'm gonna save that just in case, uh... Just in case we get shot again. I'd rather not get shot anymore today, but... If it does happen, well... Actually, that being said... They've got me paranoid. I want to be as close as possible. Oops, sorry. Okay. Let's see, is there fuel? There are generators here. We have enough though, and these are small ones. If there was a large one, I'd definitely put a core in, but... There is, actually, we're still putting a core in. Yeah, we're putting a core in because I know I'm wasting explosives on cores, but hello. We're putting a core in because fuel. I mean, why not? It's it's fuel. And I should just I should have just done this. And because afterwards it's easier to just uh, shift plus F it. Even though there was only three, that was probably not worth it. Where's my ship? Where's my ship? Uh, we're not fine. Yep, temperature. Let's actually drive closer. <sighs> yep. That just happened. Alright, come on. Come on, raise my temperature. Apparently we're suffering from hypothermia, even though we're in like 200 degree, degree Celsius temperature. <laughs> uh, it's always fun. Uh, core, please. Thank you. At least one. Thank you. I can just place it over here. Well, let's empty this out. Was it worth the fuel? Yeah, probably. Now I do actually want one of, one of these because these are tier 2 ones, medium ones. So I'm gonna take one. We have small ones, but we don't have medium ones, so it's probably useful. I mean, it's going to weigh us down by a lot. Ah, no, actually, apparently these don't weigh that much. Apparently it's just everything else that weighs too much. Alright, I'm not going to stay on this anymore. On this tool. Alright, now, I think the only one we haven't actually done is this one, which is going to be the exact same one as this. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to aim in fire so I don't waste one explosive right there's the fuel okay I just wanted to confirm that there were fuel tanks here 800 eh, still worth it you know I will take one more sure why not now, the reason I'm destroying these again it's easier for me to just shift loot this afterwards and there's really nothing else unless I want steel blocks, which, honestly, I might actually be tempted. 
But let's do one more thing before I actually start getting steel boxing started going back home. That being said, I should probably lock my doors. Okay. I really need to get a signal. Uh, signal relay here just so they can automatically lock and open. That is just so annoying when you have to do it manually. Yeah, we've gotten rid of most of the... I'm pretty sure we haven't been there. Like, almost sure. It's over there where we were, so... Let's go check these puppies out. Hopefully. Actually, there was a wreckage here. Hello, this is close. Oh, right, we already uh, dealt with the interdictors, so... Please stop with that. So, actually, we're very close to our, to our next spot. I'm just gonna quickly see what's going on. If they're basically the same wreckages, we're gonna go somewhere else. Like, for example, that single energy signature. I think it might be more interesting. I need to start slowing down <laughs> like a kilometer before we reach it. We're still not slowed down. All right, there it is. Yeah, like 600 meters before we reach it. I need to start slowing down. All right, let's see. Let's see what's here. Uh, nope. Uh, I'm willing to take that because that doesn't weigh much. Okay, sure. One crystal, sure. Anything else here? I mean, there's like two of these. Oh, hello. I'm taking these. I know they're kind of... Not very expensive to manufacture, but I'd still rather get them. Now, uh, I don't know if I finished my thought. This is cobalt, yes. Promethium, yes. Ice, not so much. Uh, this is kind of a thing now for me. I don't know if I finished my thought. I was saying that I was thinking about food. And I do know... Uh, I'm constantly thinking about food, but I mean as in, in Imperium. And we need to actually get a sustainable way of getting food, which is going to be, in my opinion, through the ship we met a couple of episodes ago, because they had a form there. The problem is I'm going to need to set up a form. So is that going to make everything explode, or is that not going to make everything explode? Why is my ship just flying upwards as soon as I press spacebar for a second? What's going on here? Oh, I, I think the upwards thrusters are not handling enough of the stopping power. Maybe? It's not happening now. Oh yeah, it is. There it is. Alright. Yeah, the uh, these thrusters, these two ones here are not handling the stopping power very well. Which that being said, before they explode, preferably I should have looted them, but... Okay, let me, let me finagle my way over here. Right. Technically what I could do is they don't have a lot of HP, so I could retrieve the blocks. I don't care about the containers. I could salvage them, they're just gonna drop their loot anyway. That's silicon. You know what? I don't care about silicon. No. No. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it with the silicon. Stop it with the silicon. Alright, so it looks like these are just one type of resource. So if I really needed silicon... You know, this this be the place to come, but... I really don't? You could explode now? Where is the explosive stuff? Oh great, I'm cold. That's exactly what I want. The problem is this is wasting food as well. Alright. Okay, where's the other thing that I wanted to say today? There was like a single energy source, not these wreckages. Forget about these wreckages. These wreckages are useful, useless. Unless I want the fuel from, uh... Where is that one? There was one here that had fuel on it. Okay, apparently if you remove the cord, it's not going to explode. It's either that or I just got unlucky with the last one. I saw it. Where was it? Why can't I see it anymore? What's going on here? Ah, there it is. There it is, this one. Unless I want the fuel from this. I guess it's probably worth the core I'm already here. That's the wrong thing. I mean, it's my last core anyway. Ah, oh, no, I don't want to waste my last core. Actually, if it doesn't have a core... Oh my god, our radiation is going up very quick. Okay, I, I, okay, so I don't need to actually place a core on it. Right, I... I'm not removing these anymore. Whatever, just just take them and leave. I gotta bother. There's only three of them. Before we get too too cold, hit the door, please. No, don't hit the door. Go through the door. Thank you. 
Yeah, close the door. I know we don't need to, but... Alright, so I know there was an... Oh, was that the energy signature? Um, that might have actually been the energy signature. Okay, we definitely don't want to go there. There's three over there, which I don't want to go to. Ah, there, there it is. That might have been the one. Alright, so let's actually quickly go to uh, that thing over there. Oh, that could be an asteroid. No, it's not. It's a point of interest. Okay. Alright, let's go. Yeah, our top speed has been reduced by a lot. Even though I did upgrade the two thrusters, it, it's still not enough when this thing starts getting full. Ah, I actually added extra... Oh, actually adding the extra expand expansion slots might have uh, might have been a bad idea. Because, yes, I upgraded the thrusters and added two more uh, upwards thrusts, but... But... Oh, start stopping, start stopping, start stopping. Uh, can't figure out. Oh, hello, we're attacking it. No, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. I didn't have control of the ship yet. Wait a minute. We know this. All right, this is actually the perfect ship to get uh, stuff from. The problem is, last time I was here, uh, yeah, we sort of lost a small vessel, so I kind of don't want to enter it. Uh, you, need, you can actually stop firing. So is the legacy actually still here? Because this doesn't... I don't recall if it says legacy or... Hello, please stop. I don't actually recall where I entered. Oh no, I remember where I entered it from. It was from over there. More or less where my cursor is pointing. But I just want to see if the legacy are here. That's it. Oh, and I can't actually explore it in your EVA suit. So I can only do like quick ins and quick outs. Uh, I'm actually curious for the legacy because if they are here, this is going to be unexplorable. Well, it looks like I'm not going to find out from this floor. Yeah, okay, let's go to the other place. I think they just used the, uh, the capital vessel. Well, there is one way to tell. Oh, it is shooting, though, and it's not going to... Why are you even shooting at a base? Why? Uh... Capital vessel and bases, that's kind of, kind of pointless, mate. Kind of, kind of pointless. Sorry. Oh, it has no ammo anyway. I guess it can shoot. Oh, the derelict ship apparently sees me and is coming after me. So it does have a CPU. Is anything else coming after me? No. It looks like nobody cares anymore. Last time. Oh, the first time I was actually in one of these ships. As soon as I went even close to it, everything started going berserk on me. So <laughs> there was even a couple of... Uh, one of the, those walking zombies or whatever they're called. I, I keep forgetting. Nightmares, I think. Just started rushing down. <laughs> yeah, I can hear them. Yeah, this is legacy infested as well. I can hear them. If I can hear them, it's legacy infested. Yeah, there they are. Can I? Actually, sorry, not that. Uh, where's the retrieve? Nope, still has a coin. All right. In that case, we don't really care much about this ship because we can't really salvage it to use it. Well, we can if we have an EVA boost and it's going to take a very long time and a lot of ammo and that's not really up to us. Now, I do know where there's a couple of containers on this thing, though, that are relatively easy to reach. They're down here. There they are. These two and there's like one or two more on the other side. Okay, I should add more thrusters. It's, it's just annoying me. I don't really need them, but it's annoying me. Because as soon as I press spacebar to go up, we're very, uh, we have a lot of thrust, so it's uh, taking us up very quickly. Okay, that's nothing. Nothing useful, at least. There's more, and there's a couple more downstairs. Sure, we'll take that. Yeah, there's like literally nothing useful here. There's a couple here. If I'm good on health, not on health, on, uh, there were supposed to be a couple here. I guess not. Okay. I really should have built the door on the other side. Seems like I'm more often coming from that side. There should be a couple here as well. Nope. There it's empty. And uh, this is more or less where we entered from, right? Around here. There are a couple of containers here, so... 
That's how a scavenger. Oh boy. Yep, yep, yep. I mean, you can spawn those alien wh whores as much as you want, but there's really nothing much I can do. Uh, really nothing you can do about it, sorry. That's what I meant, because I am not even going to enter it. Unless they developed uh, spacesuits on them. I entered from around here. I don't see the exact area. Ah, there it is. That's where I entered from. That's where I entered from. We're not actually going to go through the teleporter this time around, though. Last time was, a uh, Well, the first time was, a uh, Me exploring and... Oh, actually, inside, the temperature's kind of nice. All right. Why did I pick that up? We don't need that. Security doors locked. Let's unlock them. I mean, if something comes and tries and get tries to get us, we're just going to float away. Did I get that? Yeah, I did. There's a teleporter, which is not active. That's fine. And I think that's going to be it. I mean, what I will do is I'm actually going to go and uh, fill up the ship with... Uh, with blocks, with steel blocks. Well, not fully. I'm gonna go up to three point, like three, four, maybe around there, and see what, see if we can actually take off in the atmosphere. But yeah. Anyway, we're gonna end things off here. And again, happy holidays from me. And I've been the Rapid Mystic. I do hope you enjoyed this episode of Imperium Galactic Survival, and I do hope to see you all in the next one.